Nice road win for you guys. Come up to Cincinnati, get a 12 0 win. It's all around good team performance. Good to play, good on the mound again for you guys. Great road win. You know, Jack Perkins gets his first start and uh, has to pitch out of some jams, and we turn a nice double play. Uh, the bats got going, second time through the lineup. Uh, and then we made, you know, a lot of routine plays, a couple nice plays. And yeah, like you said, all around solid game. Uh, we like when those guys come out of the bullpen and, you know, Elliott, Hoeing, Poland, Albanese, you know. We're aggressive, we're aggressive yeah. in the zone, and made it a little easier for us. Continue to get big hits from all over the lineup. I mean, you called, you've said you guys are in a good place. I mean, this. How, how do you keep this thing rolling? I mean, what's the the formula there? Just the the, the depth. Yeah. You know that we feel like we've got those 12, 13 guys that can help us. Um, and we always say at the bottom half of our lineup. I mean, Zeke had what, yeah. four or five RBIs today, and um, you know he seems to hit towards the bottom. And you got Campbell who could lead off could hit fifth and then you know today he hits ninth you just get yeah, that balance up and down the lineup uh really helps yeah, i was going to bring up zeke you know heck of a night tonight uh what's been the trigger you've mentioned you know he, obviously he's dealt with injuries and stuff throughout his career but what's really sparked him of late uh maturity yeah. um understanding where his strengths are um i think we're doing a nice job of keeping him fresh you know him and henry davis are splitting the time together so it's a long year. We're into 40 plus games, yeah. and you know, hopefully Zeke and Henry see that as a positive that they're fresh and they're catching about two games each a week. Um, they're competing, and, you know, they're helping each other, and um, so I'm, I'm really pleased, especially for Zeke because he is a senior. Does it feel a little different this week since there's no ACC series at the end of the weekend? Does this week feel a little different? Well, I'm sure it does for the players. Yeah. I kind of addressed that today, and we'll address that Thursday in our typical Thursday practice, and. We'll have someone speak to the team, and we, we have to address it. I mean, every game now you're coming down the home stretch, so we can't really differentiate. We, we address this as a road opportunity. We only have two non-conference road games left and one after tonight. Um, we got to play good baseball, so let's not make some games more than others, which maybe you do earlier in the year. You know, now you're in lap four, as we call it, in the, in the four-lap mile. Um, so, you know, we see light at the end of the tunnel, and let's just keep playing good baseball. Coaches often say each game is equally important. As you mentioned, you're coming down the home stretch, and it kind of does make it that. So, I mean, you guys have been creeping up in the RPI, creeping up in the in the postseason projections. Do you guys keep a, an eye on how you're positioning for that postseason as far as seeding and stuff well, goes? Or I don't. Yeah. I'm sure the kids do. I mean, it's fun for fans. And somebody asked me, I was at a high school game the other night, you know, asked me about our RPI, and I – looked at him and said I have no idea what it is I don't follow that stuff I only find out what our ranking is when I do an interview and somebody says it um, I purposely didn't look at the rankings on Monday when they came out um, I get an email I see the email I don't look at it just because like I said I just want to focus on getting better we keep saying one percent better I just want to focus on these guys and let's not get ahead of ourselves let's we'll worry about the postseason when the last conference game is over and and then they say where we're at, and then, you know, but right now there's too much baseball left to play. When you say you want to continue to get better, what are some areas that you guys feel like you can improve? Well, I think hitters are always trying to yeah. uh, stay locked in, stay competitive. You know, whether they had two, three hits tonight, there's always a couple at-bats. They, they wish that they could get back. I know pitchers, after the tough weekend, you know, with Miami, you know, there's some guys that, that got back out there today. You know, that was big for Albany, and mm -hmm. Poland, um, to be aggressive in the zone and throw strikes. So, you know, you're just trying to stay sharp. You know, you never have it made. We, 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 we go from the saying, you never arrive. Once you think you've got this game figured out, and it'll humble you. So uh, we got to take, take pride and be ready uh, to play good baseball this weekend. Great. Appreciate it, Coach. Thank you. Uh -huh.